Jib, do you want to take like a YouTube vlog video? Oh. <laughs> so Making our way. Let's go. Let's go. We are here. Yeah. Vibing with the last minute tickets. <laughs> Can't believe it. Cheers! Yeah. We are sitting in our seats and it's actually not that bad. Vani and Devans are somewhere there. We've got the entire stage uh, view, like the landscape view. Which is very cool. Yeah. It depends on how she's gonna walk and stuff, but I think it's gonna be good. Sorry. I'm already hungry though. Obviously. guys so it is the next morning i am feeling exhausted i have so much to say about the taylor swift concert but i will get into that in a later part so tell the people how you feel pretty good i think i had a thorough enjoying and very good experience is you had a thorough enjoying did i did i do well no <laughs> you didn't <laughs> zero out of ten <laughs> i do wish we were set a bit closer but lesson learned for like an artist that I would want to see next. So I'm gonna take her to the front when we watch like Drake, Drake in 21. Drake in 21. Hello, hello! It has been a couple of days since the Taylor Swift concert. So I think the last video I recorded in this house was of me selling the tickets. I was really sad that I wasn't going to the concert anymore, but I was really happy that I got so much money. So I sold my tickets on the Thursday. The concert was on the Friday, but Kuldeep and I were still going to New Jersey because we paid for accommodation. I told him to take his Taylor Swift shirt with him and I'll take my jumpsuit and we'll just stay in the room and play some songs and have a fun night together and you know what that was mistake number one I feel like if I didn't go to New Jersey I would have not repurchased tickets as soon as we got to Grand Central Terminal there were tons of people dressed up for the Taylor Swift concert so seeing all of those people just gave me even more FOMO but you know what we went and we had a really fun time but now for my honest review of the Taylor Swift concert so the Taylor Swift concert was incredible she is an artiste 
but we were so damn far that we didn't see her at all. She was this small, so we ended up watching the screens the entire time. So it kind of felt like we were at a big sing-along Taylor Swift party, and since you were watching the screens, it kind of looked like you were watching a YouTube video. It didn't feel real. Now, do I think it was worth the blood, sweat, and tears in the Ticketmaster queue? No. I don't think it was worth it. I mean, maybe if you're sitting super close to the stage, it was 100% worth it. But to be sitting so far back, it wasn't worth it. It was amazing and I don't take it back and I'm glad that I did it. Will I do it again? Probably not. However, the whole vibe at the concert was something I've never experienced before. I've never seen so many people dressed up. Also, there's this whole culture that at a Taylor Swift concert you share friendship bracelets. It was so unique. I was thinking about like imagine going to a Drake concert and you have that dynamic. So yes, it was a really fun time and it was a core cool memory. But if you are one of the people who didn't get tickets, trust me, it is not the end of the world. And I kind of wish someone had told me that. But again, guys, thank you for all the love and support. I really do appreciate it. And I will see you in the next vlog. Bye!